see uh, how it does in that grass. going on everybody welcome back to the red beard saga today is uh august 24th 10 days away from the georgia dove season thought we'd do a little update dad's been doing some bush hogging looks like today thought we'd go down here and take a look See how things are progressing. Might even run some birds out. I'm pretty sure we'll run some birds. I'll we'll flip this around and we'll take us a stroll down there. See what's going on. Come up the road a while ago, I could see some flying around. Brown top. living up to its name. Seeds in there. Bush hogging is not quite the best option, but that's all we got. And all that seed. Now here, a few but here is our test strip of sunflowers we did about a month ago with the planter that daddy built now they're six or eight inches tall we decided to leave them to see if we'll make flowers Before the frost, as nice things have progressed here and stuff started to die back, the weeds have come along. There's more of them, but here's.
my sunflower patch. He mowed through it today. Got seed. Now he looks to have knocked down more than I had bargained for. There's a bunch of seed in there. Wasn't quite as weed free as I wanted, but I mean, can't complain too awful much. Heads. Got the seed on the ground, but couldn't really walk through here. Before he cut any, so like I said, I can't complain too much. We did have, I'd say, we had. 200 plus birds my dad seems to think that in the last few days the numbers have dropped some but I still look for us to have I still look for us to have a good many birds to shoot at when the season comes in A lot of this is where the finches just worked on them flowers, but there's still good Bible seed there. Turn some of these heads up. Where the birds can get to them. But, uh, see, he got into this millet patch some more. See this? seed they can get to and then right here under all of that is seed and a whole lot you can do about that we're not gonna burn we don't have bailing equipment so we'll just have to deal with it It don't look as pretty as it did, but uh, it's been a real good attractant for them. They have really been in here the last couple of weeks. If they stay, that's anybody's guess, but... getting to be 
go time for long. I still look, like I said, I still look for us to have a good opening day shoot. One way or the other, it ought to be fun. I really had a morning glory infestation. That's some of why I wanted some of these knocked down. little finches has put a, the work on some of these and some of them still got seed there's still a bunch of seed Still a little green. See, that one was mostly cleaned out anyway. But that's what you deal with when you got a dove field. about 30 of them finches flew out of there they're having a good old time I just thought I'd do a walk through Check things out since he'd mowed. We talked about him mowing. And, uh, said, uh, he got a little over anxious, I believe, but it'll be okay. There's enough here to get us through. Labor Day shoots anyway, and that's all I'd planned for. Said it Lily with it browned out like that, but that means things are getting close. I think I'm gonna get up here and sit down and watch a while. Might put in some clips of some birds coming in after they settle down from me walking around down here. But uh just wanna do an update. I seen somebody commented on the video last video wondering where my updates was. I hadn't forgot about it. Just hadn't done one. So, uh, thought I would this evening. Said I'm gonna probably cut it off here and go up here and watch birds for a little while. I'll insert the videos in of clips of them birds if I see any. And, uh, Hope y'all enjoy this. The next one I do, I'm gonna try to do a, some video of opening day. So y'all just be looking for that. Thank y'all for watching. Like and subscribe to the channel, follow along. Hope y'all are as ready as I am. Hope y'all got some birds. And I look forward to sharing a hunt with y'all. If it all comes together.
that's all for now. I'll catch y'all on the next one.